You are watching the Global Gamers Invitational Tournament brought to you by iFixit, SCVs for the real world, the handsome nerd, attire for the handsomest of nerds, and eSports United, sponsored by Intel. This broadcast is also made possible by IC Cup TV, TeamLiquid.net, and of course, Blizzard Entertainment. Hello everyone and welcome back. This is Mac with another game from the Global Gamers Invitational Round of 32. This game between Chenji so good and his opponent Az, so it's Az against Chenji, and we are on Steps of War. Once again, this tournament is sponsored by iFixit, Esports United, and the Handsome Nerd, and I have to move already because I see a very, very early scouting probe, and when you send your first scouting probe it's one of your first six probes as Protoss the Scout. It can only mean one thing. I imagine we're going to see a proxy here. And I just uh, unfortunately can't thank the sponsors at the very moment. We'll do it at the end of the game, I guess. I'll do it now. There's a proxy going on. Uh, once again, I fix it. SCVs for the real world, donating the bulk of the prize pool, but also Esports United uh, providing several Intel processors and the handsome nerd supplying many t-shirts. They are making this tournament possible, bringing out big names like Az, who will show you proxy pylons on Steps of War. Chenji so good, sensibly checks this corner. Good for him to notice this, but the pylon is already up, so he's going to bring his SCVs and engage the gateway, it seems. That is the wrong thing to target, but he can't really get at this pylon. I'm not enough surface area to bring it down, but I don't see any point in focusing this gateway. It's just going to be cancelled when he almost kills it, and then more gateways go down. Uh, fortunately, he is not building a barracks. He really needs that barracks right now. There it is. So it looks like he's going to get this gateway cancelled, but uh, unfortunately, it's just a new one's just going to be built in its place. This one now being built, this pylon completely untouched. Uh, we are still seeing some probes coming out here for As. He is up to nine workers, and that is all he needs to produce two zealots relatively continuously here does lose his probe, that is a good play by Chenji so good, uh, but he is going to take out both of these pylons and he needs to do it very soon. Are we getting a reinforcing probe? No, no reinforcing probe, so Az is feeling comfortable that he's going to be able to hold this off, this pylon not that badly damaged. No marines coming, so one marine will be coming at the same time as the zealot. In fact, a little bit uh, slower, 25 seconds and a chrono boosted zealot will be out first. First pylon is down, but the zealot is going to come out, so it's going to be a bunch of uh, a bunch of SCVs and one probe against the zealots. This zealot going to town now on the first SCV, getting a second one. Looks like no, it does pull out. Uh, the second pylon, uh, the second pylon is down. This zealot not being built any uh, any longer, and this marine is staying to fire. He should not have done that at all. Loses that Marine, that is a disaster, but Chenji now chasing down the Zealot. The Zealot has no shields, one hit will kill it, but will he get shields in time? He does. The uh, slow SCVs do chase it down, and no longer being micro, the Zealot is going down. Now three pylons being warped, and two pylons being warped for Az. Will not be able to stop these, only one Marine alive. He needs to target those pylons, he needs to target them now, he needs the SCVs to kill those pylons. Chenji is now running out of money. Here come some probes off the line for Az. He is going all in. His... Uh, he can see that his plan is about to fail. He is on the verge of losing this uh, proxy, and if he does, it's, it's game over. I don't know why Chenji canceled that bunker. That bunker could have saved his life. There's now a Zealot out focusing those SCVs, and now they are going to engage the Zealot, who is now clawing up these SCVs quite nicely. Only one Marine, but this one Zealot is going to go down. A second Zealot on the way. Soon there will be three Zealots, only one Marine. The probes are now in, and things are very bad for Chenji. Why did he cancel that bunker? That could have kept him alive. Uh, all these SCVs now engaging the Zealot, but only one Marine goes down to the Concentrated Probe Fire. And the Zealot, though completely surrounded, uh, will go down. Now there are Zealots pouring out, and Chenji, going broke it seems, only has a little bit of money left. And once this barracks go down, it is lights out. As just needs to kill it, and there are so many probes and so many Zealots that I don't see any way he can... Uh, that there will be enough Marines. There are no bunkers being built. Chenji losing more SCVs. Three Zealots is just way too much. One Marine, and uh, this... SCVs do engage, getting just torn apart here. A little bit of micro from Ass is all it takes. He does get that Marine, cleaves him in two, and the last of Chenji's SCVs are taken out, unable to handle this proxy. Uh, lesson to all you young Terran players out there, we, this is why we build bunkers. Uh, bunkers are your only hope against great early aggression like this from Az, and Chenji concedes game one. He did do very well for a while, but unfortunately just not quite well enough. 
Az takes this game very quickly. So tune in for game two. We'll see if Az uh, is a stand-up guy and lets the game go on a little longer or if he's just going to end his opponent that quickly again. And uh, also, of course, keep checking TeamLiquid.net and tuning in on IC Cup TV. And until next time, have a good one.